Can I help you? Professor, good evening. Oh, hello. My name's Chung, Andrew Chung. This is Professor Lee. Pleased to meet you. Hello. You just got back? Yes, I was in England for a week. Mr. Uh, Chang. Oh, Michael. Now you're here, I don't have the slightest chance. Ah, uh, I wouldn't say that. I owe you, don't forget. You got me the invite. <laughs> oh, come on. It was nothing, really. <laughs> well, I'm grateful anyway. Uh, just don't try to outbid me on everything, okay? Uh, Thank you, ladies and right. gentlemen. And welcome to this sale of ancient Indo-Chinese artifacts. This evening's function. Stay here. Huh? Miss? What's the matter? Oh, when you help me up, you loosen my top. You're a very naughty boy, you know. Oh, I need to use your telephone. Oh, oh yeah. Uh, sure. Yeah, what? Come and see what I just found. Right, on my way. Eleven million dollars. Thirteen million. Do I hear any better than thirteen million? Go in once. Twice. Sold for thirteen million dollars. And now to the main item in this evening's catalog. Lot number 731. An Indian sword encrusted with jewels. A fine example from the Rama dynasty. 
The supporting statue is believed to be approximately 2100 years old and is finely sculpted. The sword is inlaid with precious stones, one of which was stolen by the British. It was subsequently set in the British crown jewels. The sword was discovered on the border of China and India, and remains the only artifact of its type to have been found in that region. The jewels alone have been valued at over 30 million US dollars. Bidding will start at 50 million US dollars. Hey, catch me, gorgeous! Hey, miss, you're drunk! Oh. Hey! What's going on? Oh, oh, she's drunk, that's all. Uh, why don't you go home and sleep it off? Huh? Miss? Yeah, you shouldn't be here. Why can't I stay with you? Come on, you give me a hand. We'll see her to the front okay, door. let's go. Oh, I'm huh? feeling better now. If you guys hey. catch me, you can do whatever you want to me. <laughs> Are you serious? Come on. Oh. Hey! Hey! 55 million. I have 55 million from Mr. K.K. Ma. 58 million. Thank you. 58 million from Mr. Lo. 60 million. 60 million. <laughs> This one. Oh, sounds oh, great. Come on. Oh, but uh, I can't go alone. You guys have to come. Do I hear a better offer? Right. Ninety-eight million dollars once. Ninety-eight million dollars twice. Sold for ninety-eight million U.S. dollars to Mr. Michael Lloyd. Well, done. congratulations, Michael. Thanks for that. Thank you.
was really close. Who the hell were those guys? Well done. Professor! Professor. You took ten minutes less than I'd expected. I'd say your training run was a success. So you mean, that was a dummy run? Hmm. But you do have a mission for us, don't you, Professor? It's a notebook. It belonged to my teacher, Professor Lin Chu Po. Isn't he the one who disappeared on an expedition? That's right, a few years ago. Yes. The expedition was arranged by the university. It was investigating a legend known throughout ancient India and China. His body was never recovered, and his disappearance is only added to the mystery. That notebook is the only surviving piece of evidence we have. It is a faithful record of what happened on the expedition. Therefore, what I want to do is solve the mystery once and for all. Professor, how are we going to do that? According to Lin's notebook, the answer to the mystery is carved on two stone tablets. I already have one. You two will have to find the other one. We don't know where to look. Take the notebook. It contains clues as to its whereabouts. Go now, we don't have much time. And whatever you do, be very careful. Shame, right. we will. from the orphanage, remember? Oh, here comes a bus. Right, free ride. Let's go. I didn't know you could do this. You do now. You know, you're pretty good for a beginner. Hmm. Ivy Chan speaking. Oh, hello, Mr. Loy. Yes, yes, I did. I wanted to know if I could come by to see you. Fine, thanks. There. If he hadn't turned up there, it could have been much worse. I'm very grateful. 
My name's Michael. Yes, and we've met. I saw you at the auction the other day. Oh, I see. And your name is? Ivy Chan. I'm the one who called. Oh, Department of Antiquities. I'd like to borrow the statue with the sword. Why are you so interested in the statue? Because it's no ordinary artifact. It contains the clues to an ancient mystery. One that I need to resolve. <laughs> to be honest, I don't know much about antiques. I just collect. Oh, my father was an expert, but he's dead now. I just dabble, I guess. <laughs> There's no shame in that. Many relics have been saved thanks to collectors. If not for collectors, many artifacts would remain still undiscovered beneath the sands. So we must be grateful to you and your father. But what do those guys want with me? I have no enemies. Unless I'm very much mistaken, those three men were all members of the Wild Wolves. The Wild Wolves? So you know them? Hmm. An obscure organization, known for its violent methods. When they see something they want, they will go after their prey, and will stop at nothing to obtain it. This time, you were their target. But why pick on me? Of course, they wanted the sword. Hmm. Yes, she is naked, uh, but this is an ancient tribal wood carving, and I'm a student in anthropology. I study these relics, so to me, she's not a naked woman. It's no good explaining. I know why you bought that, you naughty boy. Uh, Look, you're blushing. Excuse me. I have to go. Ooh. Hey, wait! Hey, Georgia. I can't believe that we've been friends all these years and you made me carry these heavy things all alone. The least you can do is offer to give me a hand. I told you not to bring so many things. Look at the size of my backpack. It's your fault. I just wanted to make sure you wouldn't be short of anything like food or drink or essential supplies. Oh, right. Essential supplies. Cosmetics. You call those essential? <laughs> of course. They're essential for protecting my skin. See, I intend to enter Miss Hong Kong one day. <laughs> You're entering Miss Hong Kong? Now I've heard everything. Uh, no, wait! It's true! I know I can win it! You'll see! Excuse me, do you speak English? Mm -mm. Well? Wait a minute. Hey, do any of you guys here speak English? Me! I speak English? Really? Yeah, I could tell right away you two ladies were American. You could just call me the kid. I can help you get anything you want around these parts, like a hotel, a restaurant, a hire car. I can be your guy. Wait, I've got something else too. Look here. It's an ancient treasure map. You think it's real? Where does it lead to? To a remote and lonely place. A place where there's a buried treasure. Save it for the tourists. You can't fool me so easily. Yeah, right. You will get our money that way. But I don't want money. The map isn't for sale. Good, because we're not interested.
Mistake. I'm not gonna be put out of business by a punk like you. tell you thank you I'm really 
story. Hey, your bag! I caught the guy who... Huh? Make certain next time. Thanks so much, it's really kind of you. I guess I better lock up the sword somewhere safe. Yes, I'd say the sooner the better. I just don't know why they want the sword so badly. I have a feeling they're not interested in the sword. It's a statue they're after. Really? Hmm. some answers. That tablet for a start. What was it doing in there? Why is it so important? Why were those guys killed to get it? It's all to do with the legend. Legend? Sakyamuni Buddha gained enlightenment while sitting under the bow tree. He didn't eat or drink for many years. How did he survive? The legend said he had pills that gave him a last What's that got to do with the tablet? It said the tablet contains the secret to eternal life. If I understand it right, you want it too? Yes. I believe the tablet can provide very important information for my research. Are you angry? If I deceived you, I assure you it wasn't voluntarily. There are some things that I cannot explain to you at this moment. Believe me. I had no intention of using you. You have my word on that. Ivy. I do believe you, and you can have the tablet. But on one condition, I help you. Hey, can't you slow down a little? That's so heavy. Get a move on. <laughs> Haven't you heard of pity? Want beauty? Then you'll have to suffer for it. What can I do with my stuff? I can't throw it away. It cost a fortune. It would be a waste. Hey, kid. Huh? How much farther is it now? Oh, a couple of days, I'd say. A couple of days? I'm gonna die before we get there. You know where you're going? Sure, I brought some people here last year, but we only made it halfway. They wanted to turn back. So you don't really know where we're going? Sure I do. I know this area like the back of my hand. And I got a map, too. Stop complaining and hurry up. I can't go faster! Yeah. Hey, hold on. I'll 
take it. Oh, thank you. Get a move on. Straight ahead. Come on, hurry. Nice hot bath and a rest. I thought you archaeologists were tough guys. You're not at all like your friend up there, are you? Oh, thanks for reminding me, you little shit. Give it time, you'll become a big shit. Ugh. Your porter just went on strike. <sighs> keep on following us. Huh? Oh. oh, it's you. Another misunderstanding, no doubt, huh? Well, go on then. Let's have your explanation. Uh, well, yes, it's true. It's another misunderstanding. I'm an archaeologist on a field trip. I promise you. <laughs> of course you are. That's why you brought all those books with you, right? Uh, well, yes, you see. Shut up! Why were you following us? Uh, excuse me, but I can't breathe. And if you strangle me, I won't be able to provide you with an explanation, will I? There now, why were you telling us? My, my name's Stephen Chun. I promise you, I wasn't tailing you. I came to this region to do some research. Somebody in the village told me I should try this huh? valley. And that's how I came to be here, really. Then you are an archaeologist. Uh... That's right. I don't care what you're doing here. I don't want to see you around us. Hey, listen. It's not my fault, okay? If I see you again, I'm going to be very upset. <sighs> There's only one track. Be reasonable. I don't want you following us. But... <sighs> I don't think he meant to do it. He says it was accidental, and to be fair, I believe him. You better get going, otherwise she'll get mad and beat you to a pulp. <laughs> Why'd I have to meet you? Just my luck. Bye-bye. Hey, what are you looking at, Sonny? I thought you were gonna eat him. Hey, kid, hmm? where to now? That way. Hey, 
Forget it, he won't show his face again. Mind your own business. This would be a good place to hole up for the night. Great. At last I can take a rest. Hey, kid. I think there's a village. Let's go take a look. What the hell is this? Huh? What? Huh? They're my cosmetics! Wait! We gotta be careful! We can't upset them! Leave them! But those things belong to me! Hey, don't touch that! They may be headhunters! But they're my cosmetics! They'll cause trouble. Just forget it. We'll set up camp here. Fine. I don't want to camp here. We'll camp here anyway. I try to stay out of trouble. No arguing, just do what she says. <laughs> Kid, go get some firewood. Sure. What are all those drawings for? Oh, they're just notes. Oh, I'll go get some water. I won't be long. Don't go too far. Don't worry. Peasants, what nerve! Using my cosmetics. Uh, where are they? Ah! It's me! Why did you follow me? You heard what Georgia said. Stay out of trouble! Yeah, well, they're my cosmetics, so kiss my ass! Hey! Uh, I don't think it's a good idea. My cosmetics must be under here. Uh, <laughs> ah! oh, oh, that's horrible! Looks like the drawing in George's notebook. Huh? You're right. It must be the second tablet. And oh, I found it. How's yeah, that? Hang on. Uh, wait a minute. But it's a village shrine. We shouldn't touch oh, it. See if I care. They didn't ask if they could touch my cosmetics. Well then, it's tit for tat. Uh, wait a minute. The shrine's more important. <gasps> hey, I busted my ass to find this tablet. Well, I'm sure there are other tablets we can take. J j just leave it. There's a thief! Someone's seen us! There's a thief! Get going! There's a thief! They've got a tablet! Look there! Come on! Come on! to save us. Thanks a lot. I heard the villagers shouting, so I followed them to see what was up. Hey, kid, what was that all about? Apparently, they think we're devils. Devils? Yeah. What did you do to them? We stole their stone tablet. Tablet? What tablet? Hey, I thought I told you I didn't want to see your face around here again. <sighs> if that's your attitude, next time this happens, I'll let you get massacred. Ungrateful bitch. We didn't need you. Hey! Come on now, that's enough of that. There's no need to start fighting. It's 
far as I'm concerned, he's saved our lives. Let's not hang around here. The further we can get away, the better. Come on, kid, let's go. Right. What about me? <laughs> it's okay, you can stay. Oh, great god of the sun and moon, the devils have stolen our holiest of stones. Help us to punish them for their crime and recover our revered idol. Thank you, O oh Lord. Children of the sun and moon, listen to me now. We must kill the devils and take back the sacred stone. Kill the devil! Kill the devil! Kill the devil! Kill the devil! Good morning. Mm. Here. Smells good, thanks. Mm. Good? Yes, thanks. This reminds me. My childhood, we'd go camping. <laughs> the route we've taken. Was that to avoid robbers? Yes, they're everywhere. In these parts, you can't be too careful. <laughs> but I wouldn't worry. We'll meet up with Mandy and Georgia soon. <laughs> you know, I've heard you talk so much about those two. I guess it's about time I got to meet them. <laughs> they were orphans. I adopted them, it must be 20 years ago now. Not with the idea of training them, of course. But listening to my stories, they both began to get the archaeology bug. <laughs> you could say I was a bad influence on them, but they turned out fine young women. Now they've graduated, I'm quite sure they wouldn't want it any other way. So do you know where they are? They should now be where the second tablet is to be found. The second one? Uh, uh -huh. We'd better break camp. We've a long way to go. Yeah. Oh. No tricks. Just hand over the tablet. Uh. Oh. Uh. Oh. Oh. Come on. Get him! They came for the tablet, right? Well, I think I've got an idea. But, Michael, we're staying together. No, you gotta take the tablet. Go on. Away! Just take it. Get going. Oh, uh, I'll throw them away. Uh, Get going! What is it? Your jacket stinks. Oh, don't worry. It's bird shit. I got bombed from up there. One of life hazards. Hold oh, it. I'll clean it for you. Come here. Huh? Come along. I want to talk to you. Hey! Look, I wouldn't go near if I were you. You know what she's like. She already beat the crap out of you. You better stay behind. 
We've only known him for two days. We've no idea what he's like. He seems like a nice guy. Why can't you trust him? The only thing I can trust is you getting into trouble. Why do you treat everyone with suspicion? It's really annoying. Do you know that? Wait. Not oh. now. Is there a problem? No, no. Lead on. Hey, no problem. I think those two are falling for each other. By the way, I'd like to know if that tablet is worth some money. And also, are we going somewhere dangerous? Why, are you afraid? Of course not. Just asking. What do you think I am? Why ask if you're not afraid? Think I'm chicken? Just remember, without me here, you'd be the number two! <laughs> Did you just hear something? No? Didn't you hear that? Not me. Hey, maybe those villagers have caught up with us. You think so? this place. Ah! <laughs> 
go that way. <laughs> Talking. Save your strength. We might need it. Wait a minute. This may be our last chance for a conversation. If we keep still and quiet, there may still be a chance. I'm only 22. I don't want to die yet. I want to be Miss Hong Kong one day. Catch the rope quickly. Come on. Sounds ruin my sweater. Think yourself lucky. I swallowed some of it. I'm not surprised the size of your mouth. Dog face. <sighs> Professor, I want to show you something. It's the second tablet. Oh, it's the one I've been looking for. Thank you. Mm. I hope now we're closer to the truth. Mandy? Yes? Who's your friend? <laughs> oh, this is Steve. We met him a couple of days ago. We got into a fight, but it was a misunderstanding. We thought he was a thief. Then he ended up saving us. Isn't it wonderful? And him? Oh, him? Wait, allow me! I'll introduce myself. People call me the kid. I'm their trusty guide, leading them towards their goal. I may be young, but I'm wise and knowledgeable. And not only that, I can fight and jump like a cat to surprise my hey, enemy. Hey, wait I... a minute. Haven't you said enough? But I'm only halfway through it. <sighs> she doesn't have all day to listen to you. Oh, now, wait on. a minute. And those people? Why did they want to kill you? Well, to be honest with you... If you're scared, then you just go back. What? Go back alone? Are you crazy? Ugh. Professor, do you have any idea what to do? Not yet. But for now, we better all stay alert. <laughs> Professor, there's something strange about that Steve guy. He's not normal. If there's a fox in the neighborhood, his tail will show sooner or later. 
are we sleeping here tonight? Yes. I'll go get some firewood. Yeah, hey, I'll go with you. Let's go. Great. Uh, I won't be long. I have to take a leak. This is Steve. Can you hear me? I repeat. This is Steve. Map coordinates. 212 81 7458. go without telling Steve. Because he's a spy. He'll give us away. I've never looked for treasure before. This is the first time. So will it be dangerous? Not that it matters. I'm not scared. I'm just curious, that's all. Hey, kid. You've brought us this far now. You should go back. Here, here's some money for you. What's I this? enough, okay? Hey, no way. Sorry, I can't accept your money. <sighs> this isn't a Sunday outing. It's gonna get very dangerous. Hey, you can't do this after all I've done for you. I saved your lives. Now you want to get rid of me just like that. Professor, tell me I can stay. Professor, I really... It's all right. After all he's done, we should treat him as a friend, not an employee. All right, now she's really talking. Huh? Oh, no. Oh. I've forgotten my flashlight somewhere. Oh, what an idiot I am. I'm sure I had it. Oh, what have I done with it? Uh, I'll go back and look for it. Just wait here. No, 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 wait a minute. Professor, I should be the one to go back. Why you? Well, I'm the only man on the team, you see? So I have to look after the women, right? Hmm, well, that's very gentlemanly of you. Thank right. you. Right, stay here. Won't be All long. Right. Be careful, won't you? Let's go. I just can't believe it. Huh. You can run, but you can't hide! <sighs> Professor, is this it? We're close. According to my calculations, that is... Something doesn't feel right around here.
<laughs> Professor, they seem to be afraid of the tablet. I know. I don't understand it. Not unless... Could it be that we've discovered the lost tribe at last? Why did they suddenly appear? Uh, perhaps we're near our destination. We must be very careful now. We must be very close. Mandy, the tablet. This is the right place. Wait here, I'll go in. Professor, look at this! Look, there seems to be a gap here, as if something were missing. Professor, try fitting the tablets. Hmm. after so many years. Let's take it. Ah! <sighs> Not so fast, little ladies. What? Surprised to see me? <laughs> I bet you are. You can't brush me off. Not that easily. Yeah! <laughs> 
She'll be fine. She can take care of herself. I know she can. I'll open the box, Georgia. Quickly, Georgia, take out the notebook. Right. shows where the treasure has been hidden. It says we must look for the ancient sword. Maybe it contains the eternity pills. Oh, it has to be in there. Georgia, you must go back there and try to find it. Uh, but Just do what I tell you, please. Will you do it? Say you will. No, I can't. Don't you see if you don't find it, the wild wolves will? You have to find it. Oh.
please. Mandy, where on earth have you been? Oh, oh, I've been looking for you too. We were really worried. Oh, I know, but I got lost in the statues. <sighs> Shut up and follow me. Oh! The eternal pills are hidden. Wow! I had the jackpot! We didn't come here for that. Now put it back! Now let go! Stop it! Let's go. You're here! Thanks to you two. You wouldn't do it. You want to make a bet? Feel okay? I feel as fresh as a daisy. Oh! <laughs> 
Mandy! Uh, Mandy! You all right? Can you walk? Let's find the sword. Come on. How do we find out which one it is? There's no way of knowing, Mandy. We'll just have to be patient. Ready? Mm. One, two.
There she is. Don't move. Hold it. Sword? Yeah, we got it. Look. Oh, this means the legend was true after all. Come on, let's get you out of here. Help me get her up. We'll carry her back. Mm. Uh. <laughs> oh! Professor, don't tell me you're surprised. <laughs> you made us believe you'd been killed, but you're their leader. Bingo. They won't stop at anything to obtain their prey. Wasn't that it? So they're your assistants. Now the sword. No way. We risked our life to find it. I don't want to kill. Unless I have to. I'll be a good girl and give me the sword. Let's be honest. You have no choice. So hand it over. No, don't do it, Georgia. <clears throat> I'm waiting. You hear me? Don't waste my time. <clears throat> now that's a lot better. Well, that was a really strange dream. <laughs> 